everything is nice and stable now, and hopefully this clavicle uh, is, is able to hold up and heal. Okay guys, we're here with this gentleman. He's got a very displaced mid shaft clavicle fracture. So I was palpating here right in the X-Mercy spot where you can feel the tip of the medial uh, clavicle going right under the skin. You can feel the lateral shaft and the medial shaft. So I just connect my line here and then that's where we're gonna make our opening incision. Okay guys, we've exposed that clavicle fracture. So let's look at those and then we can correlate it with the X-ray. So this is the most medial aspect of the shaft here. You see this is the part here that sticks up under the skin that patients feel. This is that floating butterfly piece, we call it a butterfly piece. And then here's the lateral aspect of the clavicle. So the next portion, I'm gonna have to fix this butterfly to either the medial side or the lateral side and make it basically, instead of three pieces, into two pieces, and then we'll fix those two pieces back to one. All right guys, so we reduced that butterfly, that free floating butterfly piece, I've got it now reduced to the lateral aspect. So I'm gonna combine that by uh, drilling a, and putting in a screw from front to back perpendicular to the fracture plane. So hopefully we can make that one large segment and make it easier to fix onto the medial aspect of the shaft. So we're going to go ahead and put a screw in there. We call that a lag screw. Yeah, so we put that lag screw in and then secure that butterfly piece to the lateral side and then we reduce that to the medial side. This, is, this fracture is very comminuted or basically crushed so sometimes it doesn't fit very well. I think we've picked out the plate that we're going to use here. It's an Arthrex. Uh, stainless steel plate. We want to get at least through, three screws on either side of the fracture. Okay hey guys, so we have fixed everything here. Um, normally we had that lag screw. You can see that going from front to back here. That stabilized the lateral fragment and then we were able to get that piece next to the other piece. We've got a stainless steel uh, plate on top, three screws on the medial side, one, two, three screws on the lateral side. So. Everything is nice and stable now, and hopefully this clavicle uh, is, is able to hold up and heal.